was everything. It was it was beautiful. Some people said it was short, but um, I enjoyed every bit of it. No regrets. Amazing, and of course, finding this woman here. <laughs> That's actually the cherry topping, you know. So it was amazing, lovely. My stay in the house was awesome mm -hmm. i feel like it was like a dream come true okay and of course finding it... me say <laughs> <laughs> don't praise yourself Yo, you okay yeah of course finding this one here oh, okay it's so full of himself but i love him that way why why, why is it that people most times feel like if you're confident they say that you're so full of yourself yeah, right. yeah okay. cutting into my interview sorry mama <laughs> so my highlights from the house is the you know cultural days like the cultural uh performances yes presentations yeah of course and the party mm, yeah. yeah yeah i would have punched your mouth if you didn't say the party oh. i didn't mean that oh. <laughs> man the party was everything okay. it's crazy I was I I was just convinced, like I knew deep down my heart that I was gonna leave the house with not just a person, but a complete woman. In as much as they tell you that no one is perfect, we all are working towards perfection. But this woman here is everything. Like she brings it every now and then, and you're just like wondering. You thought you've seen it all, but. She keeps wowing you. She has this large heart that I'm just wondering, God, this kind of person has been in existence and I never came across this person for so many years. And, you know, so she's everything in one. Caring, loving, stubborn, <laughs> everything. But still, I love her. And I'll keep doing this forever, man. I wasn't disappointed. Okay. I was so excited. And of course, I knew I would find somebody because I felt someone would definitely find me and then I would find him too. Mm. Because I knew I was attractive and, <laughs> mm -hmm. And I felt like the right person in the house would definitely see those qualities in me and also want me to. So, of course, I came in feeling... Hold on, hold on. Were you trying to say that you didn't kind of feel something for me the first time you saw me? I didn't say that. Okay. Oh, it has always been you. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> At first, it, it was Michael, and then later on, I noticed uh, Jay, and, and that was just because he possessed this feature that I really admired, and that's like uh, showing that he's a focused man. So that kind of attracted me to him, but at the end of the day, I still chose Michael because I was like, okay, it's going to be difficult, but I'm willing to like fight for him. So yeah. So why Michael? <laughs> okay, answer. Why? Why Michael? Why not Michael? <laughs> <laughs> you want people to start filling up the venue before the date comes. Yes, you know, <laughs> it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen, and of course. Um, We'll let you guys know, definitely. I knew this question was going to come. The truth is, everyone in that house is amazing. I wouldn't come out and start singling out, okay, these guys are my favorite. And, you know, I tried as much as possible to interact with everyone and, of course, get to meet them, know who they are and understand where they are coming from and of course the aspirations and everything so i can say okay this is my favorite 
or this is people or these are the people I didn't vibe with. I literally, we literally connected with everyone, no matter how difficult it it kind of looked, but we still tried as much as possible to, you know, interact with everyone. So I can't say favorite or everyone is amazing. I'll say that, yeah. Well, I wouldn't call it change, but I think uh, a bit of uh, toning down a little bit, you know, because we all, we all, uh, we are all wired differently. And okay. the way you react to stuff is entirely different from the way I would react yeah. to the same thing. So, and that is, first of all, understanding, okay, that we are different and everything. So change is not the word. It's about understanding that we all have got to compromise at some point for what we share to grow. Do so you understand? So uh, everything about her is amazing. She's not perfect. I'm not perfect. We are work in progress. So we just keep you know, going a step at a time. And of course, God on our side, which I know he is, definitely the ship is sailing to the permanent site. He's a friend. Mm. And when I mean like a friend, a friend is like someone that you can talk to and the person will listen. Someone like you can actually rely on to take care of you when you can't, right? So he had those qualities in him and I was like, okay, with this person, I'm sure like we can build something because if you're with a friend, it's easier for people to communicate it's easier for people to walk through things together mm -hmm. so yeah mm. i feel like crying right now <laughs> <laughs> okay let me start with her first off mm. or should i say that uh, go ahead. Ahead. <laughs> well the plan is big uh, most times we look at it and it's uh it's one that is overwhelming and most times if you share it with someone the person will be like so scared you know but i know one thing for sure like i said it's work in progress a whole lot of things that we have mapped out even from the house okay. we didn't wait until we came out and started planning we had already planned and we started planning while we were still in the house so it's a whole lot of um, improvement stuff that we'll be doing definitely and like i said time with as time goes on we're going to unveil all of this and um let's not just reel it out yet okay. mm. but but we're what? still chasing endorsements why still, no? we can't just talk about those endorsements now some of them are already you know coming in okay. and so okay. as as time progress uh you know we'll definitely get to let you guys know cool. but just know that the plan everything is big we can't start enumerating all of them right here because if we start I'm not sure we're going to end today. Well, okay. it's something I would love to do, okay. but not permanently. But once in a while, I would love to be featured in some movies. And, and she doesn't want hoping, me to be featured in movies as well. And I'm hoping to produce one day also, because I actually do write scripts. Mm. Yes. And I have a lot of ideas I would like to bring out there and also i'm a fashionista so i'll be having my fashion house soon and this my young man here mm. wants to get into nollywood but i'm she not really permitting I I, that what should i do what should i do to <laughs> let you you know allow me why, why, since why? you already started spilling let's just spill everything oh, <laughs> she, I, I think from the house she made it known to me that okay you know this whole nollywood thing but definitely uh, is something that um, maybe once in a while, just know, know, just know that um, you might just be shocked one day and you see both of us starring in ju not just one movie. Yeah. Amazing. I think we should stop here. All right. Yeah, okay. Just stop here. Mm -hmm. We the Mick Cherries mm. love you guys so much, and we are so grateful for your support. And we are really hoping that you will keep supporting us outside the 
love pad mm -hmm. love you guys so much and we really appreciate god bless you all yeah and um just to add to what she said there's been a whole lot of uh, questions and you know is this ship sailing yeah. is it just uh, was it just in the house and uh, i'm here to we are here to let you know that this is not just for us to you know do it and come out and go out separate ways this is forever this is not a thing that is going to end today this is a forever thing so keep supporting we appreciate all the support and everything you guys have been amazing you guys deserve some accolades you know? <laughs> and um, just know that a whole lot of good vibes and of course beautiful stuff is going to come from us we believe god and of course uh, with your support and prayers it's going to materialize sooner than you expected.